Hey everyone, welcome back to Midday Kentucky. I don't know about you, but I know it's important to be healthy, especially when it comes to vitamins and minerals. So when I say that, I know you and I are pretty good with our food and we're getting better. Right. But are we doing the right amount of vitamins and minerals? You never know. It's so confusing There's, out there. Thank you for that. Amanda Egbert, everyone in the store, how are you? Our resident dietitian. How are you, my darling? I'm good. How are you? Fantastic. Now, this is about magnesium, everyone. Where Your do we start? You're missing mineral. Really? Yeah. Is it, explain that to everyone at home, will yeah. you? Yeah. So magnesium is a very important mineral in the body, and most likely you are deficient in it. So a lot of people feel really tired and run down, and it, it's a magnesium issue. And it's so easy to supplement and get in your diet in the proper way. Okay. I want to ask a very simple question. What does magnesium do for the body? So much. <laughs> magnesium is the fourth most abundant mineral in the body. It is responsible for over 300 processes in the body. So when you don't have enough magnesium, you crave sugar, you crave sweets. Oh. It, Makes sense. it impacts your sleep. Um, it's really um, important for people that have like migraines and, and headaches. So um, getting proper magnesium is so important. Mm. It is. It's not something you ever think about. Nobody ever says, oh, you're missing magnesium. <laughs> you're exactly right. <laughs> well, th that's going to be our new excuse when yeah. we're in bad yes. news. Why are we so deficient in it? Well, I think that we just, our food sources are not um, adequate enough. You know, a lot of people can um, benefit from some supplements that they're using. Um, a lot of magnesium is going to come from nuts and seeds. We've got quinoa. I'm glad you're is, bringing that up. Now, yes. Before you just jump into that, yeah. how do we know that these are high in magnesium? Is there something on the back of the packet or? No, I just, no. because I, would, I told you so. Okay, so <laughs> see these things here that you've brought in? Yeah. Unless I thought magnesium was in a pill, I wouldn't have thought these things that I can eat. Not at all. So Naturally. really um, dark green vegetables are a great source of magnesium, but also like quinoa, nuts and seeds are a great source of magnesium. Mm. And guess what? Dark chocolate is a good source of oh. magnesium. What? That's yeah. Good what? news. Yes. <laughs> all right. Exactly. We'll hey be adding everyone, that. But do you see it's Trader Joe's? It's not a crazy price. No, no, okay, not a crazy price. And it's chocolate. really like 72%. It's really oh. high dark so chocolate. So can we get the dark chocolate with nuts, with peanuts? With a little I mean, peanut butter? Saying, we yeah, add a little. Double the magnesium. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> double no, I'm the magnesium. I'm talking about like M&M's, dark, yeah. oh, dark M&M kind of stuff. I knew what she was on about right. there. Oh, yes, exactly. <laughs> but she did bring up a point. You know you when you're at Trader Joe's and things like that, you can buy the chocolate and peanut butter. Like the... Yes. Um, there's a, I can't it's remember like a little what it's called. Thing together. Yeah, is that type of thing okay? Well, again, you really want dark chocolate. You know, let's don't go the real crazy stuff. here. Okay. okay. No, 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 I get you. <laughs> quinoa. Is yeah, that a quinoa is a carbohydrate. Yeah, quinoa is. It's actually a good carbohydrate because it's high in fiber and high in protein, so Ooh. it helps balance your glucose levels. Okay. I also love um, electrolyte water. So I'm really? a huge yep. fan of electrolyte water. I've got it in my office. Um, you know, when I work with clients, we do a lot of fasting, and yeah. a lot of people don't feel well in their fasted state, and it's an electrolyte issue. You're low in magnesium, sodium, and potassium. So just some simple electrolyte water can be really helpful. Very quickly, we've got a minute left. Talk to me about the additives that you've got here. Yeah, just a simple magnesium supplement is also really beneficial. Um, if you struggle to sleep, magnesium citrate is a great um, product to use at night. It really helps to relax Ooh, you, this, calm you down. I need yes. that. This yes. could be the most groundbreaking information no, of the week. No, if you struggle with headaches, migraines, magnesium is another great supplement to add. And really? um, magnesium has a really short half-life. So if you're in very stressful situations, it's going to cause your magnesium to drop. So Supplementing with magnesium on a daily basis is not a bad thing. Next time you come in, which is next month, can you talk a little bit about ha like the difference of the vitamins and minerals that you buy Versus at the supermarket? Yeah, yeah because I think some are good, some are not so yeah, good. We look, have no if, idea. If you want to find out more about Amanda and how she can help you, this is really great information. Let's put up all the information on the screen now as well. There it is, very quickly on your website, you have classes that you do. Yeah, I run an online program called Lean, Living, Energized, and I Nourished. Mm -hmm. You can live anywhere mm -hmm. to participate. Yeah, yep. check it out. Check it out on the website, everyone.